Today I wanted to talk about my EDC belt pouch. It's made by Dur, and the name of this specific bag is Motion One. It comes in different colors, such as blue, gray, dark gray, like this one here, and red, I guess. The pouch itself is nothing special. It has this micro panel on the back so you can attach it easily on your belt without having to dongle it through the whole belt. It's pretty easy. And also it's MOLI compatible. So you can attach this one to a larger bag as a little side pocket for example. Also it has this little D-ring where you can attach a lanyard and have it like a little camera bag what it is made for mostly. This bag is not for EDC purposes it is made to carry a small camera or something like that. Let's have a look on the inside. In here I have a little big lighter. Eight euros in cash. Also I have this little Vera screwdriver for bits. and a little bit set with everything from Torx to Philips hat, flat hat and so on. And I also have in here the little Cyclop Mini 2 wrench from Vera, ratchet, not wrench, ratchet, from Vera. As well as two tampons, great for starting fires or if you have a girlfriend, you know. I also carry in here this Robivan Aurora A23 flashlight with a thousand lumens maximum output, USB rechargeable and with a handy little belt clip on it. Also, what's special about this model is you can take it apart and exchange the battery if it breaks down or something. Or you could smuggle, smuggle things in this empty case without drawing much attention to it. I don't know. So, what else do I have in there? This 16, 6 milliamp, 6, 6 thousand milliamp power portable power bank with two outputs and one USB C, USB Type C, and one USB micro USB input. Pretty good thing from Okazu. I'll have a list of all the items I show here in the info box. Then what else do I have in here? The Victorinox Swiss Tool Spirit X. Wonderful little multi-tool. Not pretty good for one hand opening, but yeah, almost every job you come across in your EDC daily life can be managed with this knife. There's an additional corkscrew you could put you could 
put in here to open wine bottles but everything else the only downside I have with this multi-tool is the scissors they do not open a lot you can see here there's a very very small area to cut something with for example a zip tie uh, larger zip ties could be difficult to cut with it not because it's not strong but yeah it probably would sl slip out too easily everything else on here is just great so stainless steel aluminium and yeah love this thing keep on going we have a little bottle of Jägermeister in here because as a German you always have to have something to drink with you always and the Victorinox Swiss card light with just enough tools to keep with you the best part of the, about this thing is it has all the tools that are missing in this one that you would have in a regular Swiss Army knife like the tweezers some of them even have a pen a small ruler is often found in some models a smaller blade as you can see the scissors and a little flashlight not pretty strong but in a dark situation it could help out pretty good and magnifying glass and yeah. you can google the thing I don't have to tell you everything about it and last thing in here is this little <clears throat> USB type C charging cable by Sony which I just have in there to recharge my phone with the battery and yeah as I if I'm looking on this stuff right now I think I might add another USB cable to charge this flashlight with because it is recharged via USB a micro USB not USB type C yeah that would be everything I have in my little belt pouch I usually keep this thing in a bigger bag as a small go-to bag if I have to leave the bigger bag behind I can always put this thing on and carry the essentials for a day or two in a very small package yeah